In the realm of classic Hollywood, the name Rock Hudson resonates with an enduring legacy. For many, the first recognition of this iconic actor is a significant marker, prompting reflection on the time and circumstance that brought his presence into their cinematic awareness. Whether it was through the silver screen or glimpses in the media, the question of when Rock Hudson first captured your attention opens a window to collective memories of a bygone era in film. As we delve into the cinematic tapestry of Rock Hudson's career, we invite you to share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this Hollywood luminary in the comments below. Your stories add depth to the narrative of a man who left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Now, let's unravel some intriguing facts about Rock Hudson, shedding light on the facets that shaped his journey through the golden age of Hollywood. Share your thoughts and memories and let the conversation unfold. Rock Hudson, born Roy Harold Schur Jr. on November 17, 1925, in Winnetka, Illinois, left an indelible mark on Hollywood as one of its most iconic leading men. While his chiseled jaw and magnetic presence made him a heartthrob on screen, Hudson's journey to stardom was anything but conventional. Before he became the suave leading man in romantic comedies and dramas, Hudson faced his share of challenges. Starting his career as a truck driver and later as a Navy aircraft mechanic during World War II, his trajectory to fame was a testament to perseverance. It wasn't until talent agent Henry Wilson discovered him in the late 1940s that Hudson's fate took a turn. In 1956, Hudson achieved a breakthrough with his role in Giant, a sweeping epic that also starred Elizabeth Taylor and James Dean. This performance not only earned him an Academy Award nomination, but also solidified his status as a Hollywood alister. However, what many might not know is that Hudson had a reputation as a prankster on set, injecting a dose of humor into the serious atmosphere of filmmaking. Beyond his on-screen success, Hudson made waves in television. In the 1970s, he starred in the popular TV series Macmillan and Wife, showcasing his versatility as an actor. It was a departure from his earlier roles, proving that Hudson could effortlessly transition between the big and small screens. Behind the glamorous fod of Hollywood, Hudson grappled with personal struggles. In an era where the film industry demanded a certain image, Hudson concealed his homosexuality due to societal expectations. It wasn't until the later stages of his career that he courageously revealed his true self, becoming one of the first public figures to acknowledge being diagnosed with AIDS. Hudson's openness about his condition in the mid-1980s sparked awareness and discussions surrounding the epidemic, leaving an enduring legacy beyond the silver screen. Tragically, Rock Hudson passed away on October 2, 1985, at the age of 59. His untimely death was a turning point in the public's perception of AIDS, prompting increased research and awareness. Rock Hudson's life was a tapestry woven with triumph challenges, and personal revelations. His contribution to the entertainment industry extends beyond his acting prowess, standing as a symbol of resilience and authenticity. A man who once drove trucks and fixed airplanes became a Hollywood legend, leaving an indomitable imprint on the cinematic landscape. Rock Hudson, the Hollywood legend, not only captivated audiences with his on-screen charisma, but also harbored fascinating aspects of his personal life. Authorized by Hudson himself, the biography Rock Hudson, his story delves into his private life with intricate detail. While the actor never publicly acknowledged his homosexuality, the biography sheds light on this facet, offering a glimpse into the challenges he faced amid societal expectations. Intriguingly, Hudson's personal life took a controversial turn with his involvement with Mark Christian during the period he grappled with AIDS. Allegedly, Hudson did not disclose his health condition to Christian, leading to legal repercussions. Christian, represented by Marvin Mitchelson, sued Hudson's estate, resulting in a substantial jury award of $21.7 million in 1989. This amount was later reduced to $5.5 million in 1991. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, these aspects of Rock Hudson's life add layers to his legacy, showcasing the complexities and controversies that lurk behind the silver screen. His authorized biography and the legal aftermath of his private relationships provide a nuanced understanding of the man who, despite fame, grappled with personal struggles. Rock Hudson's life story is more than a cinematic journey. It's a narrative of resilience, secrecy, and the price of fame. 
Rock Hudson, initially reluctant about adopting his screen name Rock, resisted Universal's attempt to alter the spelling to Rock, a detail indicative of his early determination in shaping his identity in Hollywood. Apart from his cinematic endeavors, Hudson formed a close friendship with singer Dusty Springfield, a bond that added a unique dimension to his personal life. In a health-related turn of events, Hudson underwent emergency quintuple heart bypass surgery in November 1981, addressing severe coronary artery blockages. Despite the procedure, he resumed smoking shortly after leaving the hospital. This decision impacted his physical condition during the filming of The Ambassador and led to strained relations with his co-star Robert Mitchum. Furthermore, production on The Devlin Connection was suspended for a year as Hudson recovered from the extensive surgery. These lesser-known aspects of Rock Hudson's life, from his name preference struggles to personal friendships and health challenges, provide a nuanced understanding of the man behind the Hollywood legend. Rock Hudson, recognized for his captivating on-screen presence, concealed a personal struggle with nearsightedness. Off-screen, he constantly wore glasses but rarely allowed himself to be photographed in them. This aspect of his private life stood in contrast to his carefully crafted Hollywood image. Moreover, Hudson's critical stance on plastic surgery took a turn in 1981 when he underwent eyelid surgery, influenced by a cameraman's persuasion to enhance his on-screen appearance. This departure from his long-held beliefs reflected the lengths to which he went to navigate the demands of the entertainment industry. In the early stages of his career, Hudson underwent surgery on his vocal cords and had his teeth capped to deepen his voice. Unfortunately, this surgical choice had an unintended consequence and could never learn to sing. This limitation became apparent when he portrayed King Arthur in Camelot, relying on spoken dialogue for the songs, akin to Rex Harrison in My Fair Lady. These lesser-known aspects of Rock Hudson's life, from his eyeglass preference to the unexpected consequences of surgical choices, offer a glimpse into the complexities that shaped the man behind the Hollywood legend. As we bid adieu to this captivating journey through the cinematic realms of Rock Hudson, take a moment to reflect on the threads that weave your own narrative with the indelible mark left by this legendary actor. Like an exquisite tapestry, Hudson's performances have undoubtedly touched the fabric of your cinematic experiences, leaving impressions that linger in the corridors of memory. What scenes resonate with you, and in what ways has Rock Hudson's on-screen prowess carved a niche within your personal cinematic landscape? Perhaps it's the charisma that radiates through each frame, or the emotional depth etched into every character portrayal. Whatever the resonance, your connection with Rock Hudson is a unique chord, harmonizing with the symphony of countless admirers. Now, let's embark on a collective voyage through shared memories. Unearth those gems of recollection, whether it's the first time you were spellbound by Hudson's presence, or a particular performance that has become an enduring muse. The stage is set for you to share your reflections, creating a mosaic of diverse experiences woven together by the common thread of appreciation for a cinematic luminary. As we celebrate the legacy of Rock Hudson, let this be a communal ode, a space where the echoes of shared sentiments amplify the impact of his contributions to the world of entertainment. Your voice adds resonance to the narrative of an actor whose brilliance transcends time. In closing, we extend our heartfelt gratitude for your time and engagement. The journey through Rock Hudson's cinematic tapestry has been enriched by your presence, and we appreciate the shared exploration of his enduring influence on the world of entertainment. Until our narratives intersect again, thank you for being a part of this tribute to a true icon.